All right, let's play the Wednesday Jeopardy game. Let's do it. Alexa, let's play Jeopardy. Fight Thursday, then Monday, and then Tuesday. I was telling, oh my God, oh my God, stop talking. I was 10 out of 12 in the uh, Thursday game. I was, the next game, the Monday game went terribly. Like, my, like as you saw there, you just heard that I started the game and then it randomly cut out. I think probably because I was blabbing on about something. Uh, but yeah, that happened to me over and over again in the Monday game. And it was just terrible to play. No fun. And then I played the Tuesday game. I just finished playing that. I was 10 out of 12 in that. That went smoothly. And now this is going to be the Wednesday game. So yeah, hopefully I can keep the momentum going. Alexa, let's play Jeopardy. To play past clues, say, catch up, or say, replay to play the latest clues again. Catch up. Let's see what clues are available. You have one day to play from this week. Here are the clues from Wednesday. Ready for the Jeopardy round? Yes. We'll see what's in store. Today's first category is... Familiar brands and songs. To get their song, Lola, played on BBC Radio, the Kinks removed a reference to this soft drink brand. What is Coca-Cola? That's right. The second category is... I didn't know that. Just rhyme with Lola. Recent books. Romance readers savored every breath. The latest bestseller by this author of The Notebook. Who is Green? Nope. The correct response was, who is Nicholas Sparks? Sparks. Do you want the next one? Yes. The next category is... Not real my style. Shooting blanks. Fill in the blank with the correct word. Kicked off in 1775 by the shot heard round the world. The battles of blank and conquered. What is Lexington? Correct. The next category is... A walk in the park. You can enjoy mountain views and wildlife on a walk through Kincaid Park in this most populous Alaskan city. What is Anchorage? Excellent. The fifth category is... <clears throat> what a circus. Chivalry Circus in London described the act of swallowing one of these as a trick in which there is no trick. What is a sword? You got it. The next category is... 434. Three, four. The response is a phrase with a four-letter word, a three-letter word, and a four-letter word, in that order. Wrinkle-free clothing is also known by this alliterative phrase, referring to its low maintenance. Something to do with iron. Please keep... Oh my god, dude. Uh, wrinkle-free clothing. I thought it's just like no iron. It's not four, three, four. Uh, repeat. Oh my god. What is iron, iron, iron? Iron, Ron, iron. Repeat. Stop. Alexa, let's play Jeopardy. This! You've already played a game today. Earlier, we recorded your score as 10 out of 12. Say catch up to play any days you missed this week, or say replay to repeat today's clues. Catch up. Let's see what clues are available. You have one day to play from this week. Here are the clues from Wednesday. Looks like you didn't complete all the clues from this day. To finish off the remaining clues, say resume, or replay to start from the first clue. Resume. All right. Let's 
move on now to the double jeopardy round. The seventh category is <clears throat> a long, long time ago of clothing, paper or the wheel, the one that humans began using first. What is the wheel? That is incorrect. The correct oh, response yes. was, what is clothing? Ready for the eighth clue? Yes. The eighth category is... Silly. We were using the wheel before we were wearing clothing. Art and artists. After years of studying law, Paul Cezanne convinced his father to let him pursue art in this capital city. What is Paris? Yes, that's it. The next category is... African-American actresses. She said, sometimes as a parent, I think. I'll handle this like Olivia Pope, her character on Scandal. Who is Washington? That's it. The next category is... Yes, kids. International disputes. An artificial reef started a beef between the British territory of Gibraltar and this neighboring nation. What is Spain? That's right. The eleventh category is... Dates. On this date in 1969, the Apollo 11 astronauts landed on the moon. What is July 11th? That's not it. The correct response was, what is July 20th? 20th okay. Do you want the next clue? I don't know why I had 11 in my head. Yes. The final category is... Crossword clues V. The response starts with the letter V. Hooks and loops in noisy harmony. Six letters. Repeat. Please give... Hooks and loops and noisy letters? Starts with a V? No clue. Repeat. Oh my god, dude. I don't know why I had, why I know why I had 11th in my head because it was Apollo 11. And yeah, I guess I just stuck with 11 because that's what I heard and that's what I went with. And Oh my god. But I knew that date. I absolutely knew that. Alexa, let's play Jeopardy. So dumb. Alexa, let's play Jeopardy. Stop. Alexa, let's play Jeopardy. Do you want to hear today's stats? Yes. All right, let's see how you did today. Not bad. You've got 7 out of 12 correct. You scored in the top 27% of players today. We'll see you tomorrow for more clues. Nightmare. Yeah, the, with the speaker cutting out like that, I don't know. Well, I guess I was going to be... Well, I shouldn't have missed that Apollo 11 one, but... Uh, so I probably should have been like 8 out of 12. But yeah, the two pretty bad games where the speakers were cutting out, both were 7 out of 12. That's <coughs> why I'm sick, and it's late. <coughs> Can't even talk. Uh, but yeah, the other two games I played, I was 10 out of 12. I was also 10 out of 12 in the Sports Jeopardy game. <coughs> Thanks for watching.